y'all welcome back to my channel i am simply brentley don't forget to get your energy in and like comment and subscribe for all of your manifestation needs as well as for personals head on over to my website energyllc.com the link will be in the description box below holy father angels ancestors speak through me if i reach one person and one person alone which i know i will please and thank you let's go ahead and ground all right <clears throat> Excuse me. So this is the energy that I have. I have um, what God has for me. It is for me. What God has for me. It is for me. I know without a doubt that he will bring me out. What God has for me, it is for me. All right. So somebody has been wavering. On, they Somebody hasn't been putting enough respect on their own name. Okay. Somebody has been feeling lower vibrational. This is for this person. Okay. Um, this group, whoever. But I know that I feel the energy of somebody that needs to put some respect on their own motherfucking name. Okay. Somebody that has been taken less than. Somebody that does not deserve what they have been accepting. And it's time for you to go ahead and change that shit. Okay? Because it's for you. It's for you. It's not for anybody else. It's not for you to be taking anything less than. Anything lower vibrational. It's for you to take everything that is yours. And you deserve the shit. Right? You're a hard worker. This is somebody that works hard. This is somebody that spreads love. This is somebody that is very much so, very much so in tune with everything around them and they always are give, willing to give it a helping hand when they can so i just want to uplift you i just want to let you know that it's for you it's for you all right let's go ahead and use my star seed oracle deck because you are star seed definitely speaking to a star, a star seed here i'm sorry first thing i cut the deck on i'm sorry and then message okay so this may be where you need to Somebody needs to apologize to you, right? They owe you the apology. And and you've been accepting less than, but this person owes you an apology and they want to give you this message, right? And, you know, if there's something like, it says right past wrong. So somebody wants to right some wrongs that they have done in the past. And they want to send you a message about this, right? But you know that you don't, you can go ahead and take that message that set that shit and all that, but you're not required, you're not required to put up with anything like that does not set up, that does not feel good in your energy, period. Okay, but that's the first thing out. This tap, okay, and then after that, look at what we have. Karmic relationship. So, it definitely could, relationships, with the plural on that bitch. So, it's definitely like this person within some type of karmic relationship, where they might have thought this person was their counterpart, but they were really just a lesson for them. And because they didn't realize that this person was a lesson for them, they did you wrong. And them doing you wrong made you feel bad about yourself. It made you feel lower vibrational. It made you feel like, damn, like why, why, like I'm very attractive. I'm very beautiful inside and out. Why the fuck is this person treating me like a motherfucking option? Period. You don't deserve that shit. All right. Let's see what else we have. We had trust the timing. So um, this person, you know, like you, you felt like you've been waiting a long time for some shit. You felt like you've been putting your... Okay, and, and look at this. It's like child. Three. So something's been divinely guided. Something's been divinely guided. And then also there's some something like as far as childhood wounds, childhood trauma, trauma binding with this karmic relationship that this person was in. Um, and I'm getting was in, okay? So it may be in the past. Um, but it's definitely like because of this lesson that they need to learn. They weren't putting any respect on your name. They weren't making you a priority. They were treating you like shit, basically. Treating you like shit. And they wanted to have control over the situation, but they can't control. You can't control everything, right? So, like, this person was having some addictions. They were having some things that they were using for coping me mechanisms as far as whether that be addiction, people no longer that no longer serve them around them, but I, they have some type of addictions. Anything that is not for your greater good that is affecting you is an addiction, right? Anything that you can't easily let go of that is affecting you to the negative is an addiction. Okay. So the great severing right after that. This person realized that they have to let go of some shit. They have to cut ties. 
they had to cut ties because there was like some type of, okay, I got demon energy. I, I, there was some type of demon attached to them. And because this demon was attached to them, they had to go off to themselves. And like, there was a lot of darkness around them. They were avoiding a lot. So it was like this dark night, this darkness around them. They had to, spirit had to be like, okay, I'm going to show you signs. I'm going to show you synchronicities. I'm going to show you constant reminders. But since you still don't want to follow that, you're going to have to go through this, right? And ain't nobody with you. You just, it's just you and God. Ain't nobody with you. And it's been a hard time. Take it how it resonates, flip it and reverse it. It may have been you that's gone through a hard time. But I'm definitely feeling somebody that needed to put some respect on their own name. Somebody that was being mistreated. Somebody that did not value themselves, right? We have a lot of time in 2022 and we talk about the value of people, right? And, you know, that's not right to put a value on a person or whatever. You know, we talk about that in slavery days or whatever. Not or whatever. I'm not saying it like that. But I'm just saying we talk about putting a value on people. High value women. High value men. All this shit. Y'all have heard the sayings. But it's like, right here, wait. It's like, wait a motherfucking minute. Let me go enter. Let me let me in, do some introspection. Let me go ahead and go within myself. Because it's not about the people around me. If I know what my value is, then I would know what I can accept. Then I know that I'm accepting some shit that's less than. And that's the energy that I have. It's like you wake up one motherfucking day and your eyes are, your third eye is open. It's just open one day. And everything is like, different colors and everything is different right because you haven't seen shit like this you've been carrying the weight of the world and you realize when when you wake up it's like a snap of a finger that the word the weight of the world is not yours to carry you have your powerful team of ancestors around you you have your spirit guides around you that are leading you to what you need to do you just have to follow that shit and you have to okay so i have a reintroduction allow me to reintroduce myself so like i have jump in right now and like somebody is about to come out and you can reinvent yourself multiple to a, a multiple times. Continue to reinvent yourself. Ain't nothing wrong with that. You don't think that these people that are very successful, like the Steve Jobs out here in this world, like the, um, like the, um, Elon Musk out here in this world that has like billions of billions of dollars. You don't think they reinvented themselves for some shit that did not work in the past. Ain't shit just jump off of them right away. So I have jumped in. And with this, it's, it brings me back to um, a childhood, whatever you want to call it. I don't know. A, a childhood little dance or song or whatever you do. And it's like, jump in, jump out, turn yourself about. I said, jump in, jump out, introduce yourself. And then whenever you introduce yourself, you like clapping and stuff. And everybody's in a circle. And you're like, my name is Brentley. Yeah. And I'm a whatever. I'm a healer. Yeah. I'm going to be a healer. Like, whatever you want. I'm in my abundance. Yeah. Every day of my life. Every day of my life. And then everybody's cheering for you. Like, woo! So I really feel a, a big cheer for you. I really feel somebody reinventing their self. I really feel like you are stepping into your... You're stepping into your abundance and you're claiming that shit. You're not ashamed of that shit. You're not ashamed to, like... People can call it what... I ain't saying she a gold digger. Like, people can call it gold digging if you want more for yourself. You don't want nobody that does not have anything to bring to the table. That's not a motherfucking gold digger. It's not. It's just you knowing who you are. It's you knowing what you deserve, right? Somebody gonna have to match you or, like, be better, right? At this point in time, they gonna have to be better because you've been through some shit. So they gonna have to prove some shit. And it's not like you're not gonna show that unconditional love, too, as well. Child of the Cosmos. The intelligence lies within you. You are God. You are a goddess. <laughs> and some people can get offended when I say that. You're a God and you're a goddess. But I don't give a fuck. I really don't. Because if you understand the power that you have within yourself to be able to hone that in, it's everything. It's everything, right? If he created us in our, his own, he or she created us in his own image, done why wouldn't we have the power to right understand that understand that so it's, it's very much like you have the power within yourself and you have been playing yourself in a in a inner earth okay inner earth inner intersection energy 
your energy is always like great. Your energy, you know, we have those low vibration energies. But I, what I mean when I say your energy is always great, you know what's right. You know what you're led here to do. You know that it's about growth. Look at all this greenery. Look at all that greenery and the water. You know it's about growth and being your true unconditional self and letting that shit go because whenever you're trying to get validation from outside sources, it never fucking works. You don't need that validation. You just need to go within yourself and anything within yourself is worth it, right? You're worth it. You're, res you're worth everything. It's time for you to put some respect on your own motherfucking name and it's time for you to call shit for how you truly see it and move on and grow. Yeah, because somebody's been in a five of cups. Somebody's been grieving. Somebody's been regretting. Somebody's been feeling very des desperate in despair. And you don't need to feel that way because justice is here. Justice is here. You don't need to feel that way because you have the power to get in your full energy and not give no fucks. Create your own new beginning because you have this new life ahead of you, right? You can disregard what anybody else thinks. You don't give no fucks. Of one, this is all 1101. Get in alignment for the motherfucking assignment. You can do it. You got it. Greatness is within you. It is. You are greatness. You are abundance. You are love. You are peace. You are hope. You are everything. Right? You are everything. And everything is you. So you're everything. You're this free spirit. You're this person that loves to love. And, and get into it. Just get into it because you deserve that shit. You deserve to get that shit reciprocated. And you deserve to put some respect on your own motherfucking name. Don't for one second think that you can't do this shit. You can do it. You can do it. You can do it because you have it within you. And you know you can. You know it's not your time to for a demise. You know it's your time to gain. You know it's your time to win. You know it's your time to keep on keeping on. Keep on keeping on. Death. And then page of pentacles. So you're changing. You're transitioning. You're no longer accepting that lower vibrational shit. That low self-talk can no longer get to you because as soon as you hear that shit in your mind and it's lower, you know it's not you. Because you are this higher vibrational creature. You are this higher vibrational you know, being. And you're getting this good news. You're getting all of these manifestations. And it's because you've been diligent and you've worked hard on that shit. And even though you may have not put no respect on your name, it's like you woke up and you're like, hold up, wait a minute. Let me put some respect on my name. <coughs> Excuse me, y'all. Let me put some respect on my name. I just got like sickness when I cough. Anybody that was taking advantage of me, any type of lower vibrational things that I have been thinking or have that been on my mind, any type of sickness, any type of things, that shit is gone. It's I have the power with me, in me. I have the strength within me to go towards what I know. To go towards what I know I deserve. What I know I'm here for. What I know is meant for me. And I'm going to go ahead and close it off by saying, what God has for you is for you. Period. It is for you. So continue to be strong. Continue just to work on yourself and understand that it's about growth. And just cut the deck on six of wands. And you will be winning. You got the victory. You got the victory, victory. Victory, victory. Jesus. So yeah, you've definitely got the victory. Rewards, gifts, abundance. Because of this battle that you have fought. Because of this strength that you had to show. Through these demons that tried to pull you down. And you were able to get through that anyway. You have the victory, and it's yours to have, and you deserve it. Yes. All right. Y'all know I get excited. This is great. This is good. This is awesome. Don't forget to get your energy in and like, comment, and subscribe. For all of your manifestation needs as well as for personals, head on over to my website, energyllc.com. The link will be in the description box below. As always, peace, love, and namaste.